I wanted to give an overall progress update to show how much we've done so far. Still a ton of work to do, but just to give you an overview of the flow. Last year we had props only along one side and trying to make it more of a walkthrough this year. So we're going to have witches on both the left side and right side as you pass through. The one covered up over there is Lunging Witch. Plan to put a fog machine in the house, the cottage, and uh, that should look pretty cool at night. Maybe some lights in there as well. Have both cauldrons, last year's and this year's. We'll be adding some potion bottles to the table. Up next, the dinos. Please excuse the mess everywhere. All the bags are gonna be going back on soon to cover up all these props because rain is in the forecast for tomorrow, which is why I wanted to kind of give you a quick update before that happens. And uh, trying to cover up the bases a little bit with some pumpkins. And as you can see, the scarecrows are also going to be on both sides. Uh, the spot over here next to the bridge is going to be for Sleepy Hollow and we'll put the Headless Horseman back in the woods. And we are trying to swap parts from the Lunging Reaper and Hugs so that Hugs will lunge. Switched out the box already and the phrases and mouth are working. I uh, just have to work on connecting the Lunging wires because they're not a perfect match. Uh, they're the same amount of wires, but it's basically kind of a male-to-male -male plug it's just backwards, so I'm going to have to probably cut it and see if we can make that work. Most of the clowns are still covered, but cleaning up a little bit in here, not too much. Got, away, got rid of some of the boxes. I'm going to take that slide off, give a little bit more passing room. A lot of props are in the wrong place. A lot of stuff is in the sewer just to keep it covered so I don't have to throw garbage bags over it. Um, most stuff back here is also covered. Haven't done much back here in a while. Can almost walk through the sewer again. He has, these have to go into the carnival section. Put a lot of carnival stuff in here because it's right next to the carnival so just to keep it protected until everything really does go back out henry hustle he has a little ways from home back here uh, we have the headless horseman started just wanted to kind of test out his mech because i purchased him used and um, wanted to make sure he was in good working condition he is, just gotta get all the clothes and coverings and stuff set up the right way. Um, we have Rising Woman, who has to go all the way up front in the asylum, but because I can't really cover her with the garbage bag, have to probably be more like a tarp, uh, I threw her back here for now. On Living Forest is shaping up. Probably have to move him back a drop so that people can pass. Mr. Howell and the werewolf section will greet you as you come out. Across the way will be the underworld section. I'll probably put some kind of poster or something in the windows. Right now this shed is just filled with boxes. Um, across the way here, people might miss this. I need to make a way to kind of wrap back around to see the butchers. Um, but I guess after you come through the scarecrows, you can cut over this way and see them. Then we come through, Mon Stars, that'll be lit up. We are going to be running some red carpet. We need to tack it down and make it look nice and straight and even and neat. Um, but we have Reagan and Krampus and 
this is a surprise. I'm not telling you what that is just yet. Jack and Sally. Uh, Zero, we gotta figure out how to make him hang a little better. And the boys, Freddy, Jason, Mike Myers, Pennywise. Uh, I have Beetlejuice here. He's going to go next to Pennywise on the red carpet. So that he's also kind of near the cemetery, which makes sense because he'll have the tombstone that he's sitting on. And cemetery is still looking pretty much the same. I did add Teary the Clown here. Uh, a couple of people told me I should probably try to move him to the clowns and carnival. I kind of like him here. Tell me what you think makes more sense. Um, the platform up here is going to be for caretaker. Uh, he's built, he's just not out yet. Coming around, this is going to be, this is not in the right location. This will kind of go over that way a little bit more, but we're gonna have all the zombie babies in their little playground, uh, climbing the ladder, going down the slide, climbing over the walls and stuff. On the other side, of the butcher shop we're going to have our zombies as you can see pete and marie are the only two that survived in this section since last year many of the others like miss mercy uh all got moved to the asylum just thought that was a cooler spot for them um dolls are gonna go kind of where the zombie babies are but there's rocking horse dolly we have our spiders I'll tell you guys it was really hard hanging that spider up there I got some of these guys, which I'm going to dangle around as well. Some skeleton spiders. Uh, a lot more work to do. I took down Cocoon Corpse temporarily just because of the rain, but he'll go back up soon. Easier to just throw him in the shed for now. We have our Haunted Mansion spot with our flying ghosts. The hitchhiking ghosts in the back. They're black light respondent, as I've mentioned in previous videos, but haven't tried them out just yet. Uh, w Wraith is covered up over there. We have our pillars. Uh, if I do ever get the 15-foot phantom, if he ever comes back from being on back order, he's going in this section as well. A couple of other ideas, um, but more on that when I, when I work on it. And over here, just like last year, we'll have Mr. Dark popping up on the other side of the entrance to greet some people as they approach. And this morning... I got the Inferno Pumpkin up as well. So he's looking good, ready to go. Test it out, works great. And need to put all his buddies with him as well, but haven't gotten to them just yet. There's our progress update. Let me know what you think. Let me know if you have any suggestions to make anything better. Uh, let me know if I walked by something and didn't mention it because I just kind of forgot. Um, but that's what we're looking at so far. So yeah, please like and subscribe. Let me know what you're thinking. And it's coming up soon, guys. Happy Halloween.